Hey guys, this is Andre from Cryptomaton and this is the first video in a series designed to help you build your very own crypto trading bot from scratch. As a result, we're gonna start with very basics such as installing Python and a few other requirements needed for you to start coding. This also serves as a crash course in Python if you're looking for a more action-based approach to your development learning. If you haven't been following this channel along, this is a great time to do so. Make sure to hit that like, that subscribe button and that notification bell. Without further ado, let's install Python, pip and an IDE. So I realized while I was editing this video that I didn't really explain what a trading algorithm is or does. So just let me give you a top of the line idea of what we're trying to do in this series of videos. If you already know what a trading algorithm is, then please feel free to skip this part and jump into the action. A trading algorithm or a crypto trading algorithm refers to a tool that is designed to automate and improve upon a manual trading system. That is to say, it enables you to perform certain trading strategies that otherwise you wouldn't be able to do manually. That could be because of time constraints, human limitation or emotion. In the past, I've built several crypto trading algorithms that enabled me to trade in a way that I wouldn't be able to manually. For example, I built a trading algorithm that detects each volatile coin on the Binance exchange and that is among 1500 coins that Binance lists and allows you to trade. A human would not be able to do this kind of thing, but a program would. And that's exactly what we're trying to do here. So without further ado, Let's actually jump into it. Cool, so the first thing that you want to do is navigate to python.org slash downloads and download the last version of Python. In this case, we have Python 3.10.1. Make sure to download the correct version associated with your OS, click download, and then proceed to install. Now, I'm not going to install the package since I already have Python installed on my machine, but you would need to just simply click install now while allowing Python to be added to path. Now proceed with the installation and next we will be installing pip. But first let's understand what pip is and why you're going to need it. Like many other backend languages, Python comes with an amazing out-of-the-box solution that already includes a lot of libraries and functionalities making the language very versatile yet easy to use. PIP extends on this functionality by providing a package management solution which allows you to extend and expand on the original functionality of Python. While Python is already quite a versatile language, something like PIP allows you to install external packages which further improve the versatility of Python. Now without further ado, let's go ahead and install PIP. Right, installing PIP is rather easy, all we need to do is just run the following command into our CMD or terminal depending on what operating system you're using pi m ensure pip dash dash upgrade now you'll see that the response that I'm gonna get is that the requirements are already up to date which means that I already have installed pip on my system but in your case you will just have to wait a few seconds until the installation is complete if you are installing this on Linux or Mac you will want to replace the pi command with Python instead Cool, now there's only one last requirement left before we can finally interact with crypto exchanges in order to programmatically trade cryptocurrencies. And that is having an IDE. An IDE or an integrated development environment is just a fancy word for essentially a program that allows you to test and write code, like a Microsoft Office for coding. Uh, so there's a lot of great IDEs out there for Python. Um, I would recommend starting off with either Atom or VS Code. Both of them are really good. Atom is a bit more simple coming out the box, but you can modify it as much as you want. In this video, we're gonna install Atom and I'll show you how to install it as well as how to use it to run your first line of code. And of course, don't forget to check your portfolio before proceeding. All right, so the next thing we want to do is just download Atom. So just simply type into Google download Atom or go to atom.io and download Atom. Once the installer finish, launch that, go through with the installation and you're basically done. Alternatively, you can just do the same thing with VS Code. Now in Atom, there's one more thing that we need to set up in order to be able to run our code as Atom is not by default able to run it. So let me just quickly show you how to do that as well. 
And finally, now simply navigate over to atom.io slash packages slash script and install script. This will allow your Atom IDE to run Python scripts. In Windows, you can do this by running Control Shift B or Command Shift B on Macs. If everything that you've set up is correct, you should technically be able to run code and now integrate with cryptocurrency exchanges. Okay, so now just to test that everything works correctly, just go ahead and create a new file. Call it anything you want, just call it test and then make sure to remove the txt extension and replace this with .py. So we're gonna call our file test.py. Now open this in Atom and now we're gonna check that the file actually is a Python file and that the Atom interpreter is being installed correctly. So we're just gonna give it a simple logic expression for it to, to print us out to see if it can actually run the code. So we're just gonna say, if true, print yes. Control Shift B. Yeah, everything works as expected. And there you have it. These are all the bare bones that you need in order to eventually run your own crypto trading algorithm. If you like this video, click like, click subscribe and hit that notification bell. Again, this is a new series of videos that I've started doing, so any feedback is greatly appreciated. Did you find this video useful and informal? Did you manage to follow all the instructions in the video? Was it too slow? Was it too quick? Uh, please tell me how you found this video so that I can adjust for future videos. Do you like the idea behind this series at all? You know, super important that I understand what kind of content you guys like so I can provide you more of that. I'll still be doing my crypto trading experiments and I'll keep you up to date with my bots and I will share other bots with you. But I've decided to supplement my channel with more bite-sized chunks of information that are tailored for people who are just not so savvy with crypto trading algorithms or with coding in general to kind of kickstart their, their journey into algo trading. If you want to talk more algo trading, please make sure to check the Discord links down below. I have a group of about 4,000 people where we're all discussing certain bots or simply just talking algo trading or trading in general. You can also read through my blogs or alternatively just check out some of my previous videos. If you really like this content and you want to support what I'm doing even more, you can always purchase a premium Discord subscription for my Discord channel. This will give you access to a couple of exclusive channels within my Discord server and will also allow me to uh, get myself a cup of coffee in the morning or something like that. Alright guys, Cryptomaton out!